Um, for 2007, the limits are this little red box right here. And uh, actually, the hydrocarbons in NOx are reduced by about 50% from about 2.5 down to about 1.3. And the particulate matter is reduced by 90%. It goes from 0.1 gram per brake horsepower to 0.1, so a 90% reduction. And how we do this is we've added several new enhancements um, to the new engine, the new 6.4 liter diesel that, that's out in the F450 outside. We have this thing called an active diesel particulate filter that actually traps these, uh, these particulate matters, stores them in this thing called a diesel particulate filter, and when it, you get enough of them collected, there's some uh, fairly intelligent uh, control system that actually helps us burn all that off. So it comes out as, um, as hydrocarbons as a, and, and very well combusted hydrocarbons instead of particulate matter. We have an enhanced uh, EGR system, an exhaust gas recirculation system to help us focus on the NOx. We have a very uh, sophisticated um, fuel injection system which gives us what we call multi-shot capability. You know, it used to be you just squirted it in once Per revolution. This allows us to maybe do a pre-injection, a main injection, and a post-injection, which helps us manage the overall emissions. A lot of new electronics, um, increased tur turbocharger boost, and uh, we've got a, a brand new engine structure. Um, this is the new 6.4 liter that's um, available in the 2008 F-150, you know, the F or F Series Super Duty, excuse me. Um, you know, Ford's been the truck leader, will continue to be the truck leader, and this is really <coughs> Another, uh, another jewel for us to, to maintain our overall truck leadership. It has a uh, 6.4 liter, it has a high <coughs> pressure common rail injection system, again, with the ability to do multiple injections uh, per, uh, per engine revolution. It has two turbochargers in series, and it has a, an EGR system with a high torque motor that actually opens and closes the EGR valve. The exhaust system, the engine's actually up here. You have the downpipe. We have a diesel oxid oxidation catalyst right here. And then we have this thing called the diesel particulate filter that stands right here that, that captures all that particulate matter. And that helps us get that 90% reduction in uh, particulate mass coming out. This is a very interesting technology. It's um, silicon carbide, um, very small honeycomb, probably one inch by one inch. They put these things, they furnace brazen together like 2,000 degrees. And uh, they get these, you know, 12 inch by 12 inch bricks out that are probably, I don't know, 12 or 18 inches long. They grind them, um, they put them in here, and it, uh, it's a very interesting technology. It kind of holds the height, holds the uh, particulates for us. We can assess uh, how full it is, and then we, uh, we change and use that multi shot injection system to help burn all that stuff off, and it uh, comes out very, very clean. You know, we've got a resonator and a tailpipe. This was, uh, this was something I hope you guys can see it. This is kind of current technology, and this is what 08 looks like. So you can see all this nice black powder in there that this gentleman has uh, gotten out of the uh, back of the exhaust pipe. And this is the uh, new clean diesel, where essentially you see virtually none. And, uh, we're very proud of, uh, of the product you see out there, of this new engine that's going in it, and what we're doing, again, to address, um, to address the effects of, uh, of this on the environment. A um, little bit about the engine, it's uh, 650 foot-pounds of torque, 350 horsepower, um, so it's, it's a beautiful uh, truck out there, I've had a chance to look inside of it. But. We're probably picking up and pull this hotel down the street. Yeah, I think it's <laughs> The other thing you'll notice um, when you see this, this these are uh, sound power levels, and the, kind of the pink is the, uh, um, is, the, is the new engine, and the darker blue is the old engine, the current 6 liter. Lower is better, and uh, what you'll see is, you know, we're getting about, it's like in this area, about you know, 10 dBA lower, po lower power or lower sound pressure levels. So this will be a significantly quieter vehicle um, because of the, uh, the ability we have to better control the, uh, in the injection um, timing, which um, helps us control the combustion process, the sound pressure levels, as well as, as, well as the emissions. So anyways. We're very excited about this product and we believe it will help us maintain our leadership in the truck market.